Hello, everyone. Welcome to Master Li Jing's Tai Chi Kung Fu channel. Last time we practiced about basics, how to warm up. And today, specifically, I want to teach people how to do the Tai Chi steps. Very detailed. Let's follow me. Now, as you can tell, I have a straight line in front of me. So what you're going to position yourself is on the line, a little bit on the side. And then twist to the toe going to 45 degree. And put your hands behind to spy your spine. Make sure the tailbone is not going to stick out. Make sure the tailbone is sitting down like sitting on the chair. It's very important to posture your body straight. And also spine go to the ceiling. And relax the shoulder. Now, see, the back is a spy on your, spot on your uh, back area, tailbone area. And 45 degree. Uh, put your one leg, toe on the ground. Very empty. It's called empty stance. And number one, turn your body forward. This way, hip, shoulder, go to direct, forward. And knee open. Now, the most important, use your heel landed. And when you're landing, toe going forward, back leg pushing. The lines in between your leg. Open your toe, back leg, toe off the ground. Put your knee 45 degrees. See that, my hip? My shoulder, my foot turned to the 45 degrees by your tailbone. And knee open first, directly leading your body to the direction you want to go. And land it and heel down. Toe land forward, back heel, pushing the body forward. Absorbing the energy going back. And land it to the 45. And leg up, up the floor. Knee up, turn waist, step out. Land it and pushing forward. Finish. Let's watch one more time. Turn to the 45. Drop the body. Turn waist. Step out. Back leg. Pushing the power to the end of your knee and bounce back like water. The foot position is very important. Okay, turn waist. Open your knee. Land it and pushing forward. Open up your toe and back click and off the floor. Open your knee and step out. Land it and back leg pushing forward. Let's finish. The key for the taking off is really what the Kung Fu is about. From the profile, when you watch from the side way, bounce back. Number one, my knee is not over the toe. And bounce back. Check out my my tailbone down, spine up. Turn your body to 45. Watch the heel off the floor. And body turn 45. And use your toe off the floor. And still keep the body posture straight. Knee 45 degree. And step out, land it, and push. Everybody watch the from this side. Bounce back, open toe, and back off, step out, and back leg pushing forward from behind, 45 degree, and turn your knee forward, guiding the toe, step out, toe landed forward, back leg kicking, and toe up, shifting over, heel up the floor, lifting up, turn hip, Open your knee, step out, pushing forward. Again, 前腿弯，后腿直，向后坐快，脚尖四十五度，后脚跟起，脚尖离地，膝盖冲四十五度，然后膝盖打开，把身体冲着前，慢慢的伸腿，脚尖冲前，后腿推，然后前回来，身体正
直线在两个腿的中间，坐跨，转身，踩脚，踢脚跟，后腿 up， 踢开，转腰，打开膝盖，上步，破式，转身，带，二，回，转，打开。Land, push, finish. 大家看到了啊，整个的动作 ，the whole entire movement. I'm break down two steps, few steps. 我把整个的动作给它分解开来。Spy your elbow, bend your knee, forty-five. 蹲四十五度。Put your knee open. Stick out your foot, heel on the ground. On the other side of line, back heel pushing the energy forward and bounce back. Open your toe, back leg off the floor, heel off the floor first, then toe off the floor. Extremely looking for the five toe, really train the small muscle on the five toe to grab the floor. That's what the footwork is about. The train your small muscle. Turn 45, back leg up. Off the floor, and turn waist, step out, land it, and back leg push forward. Exerting back, open your toe, step down, heel off. Off the floor, turn waist, keep going forward, bounce back. Finish. Now, going backwards, everybody from behind, you can watch me from behind. One more time. Watch from behind. Sit down, like sitting on the chair. Open, step out. Back leg pushing, bounce back. The key, number one, toe has to be forward. Number two, the second your toe down, heel up the floor, and put your toe towards to the 45 degree, and off the floor. This time, knee is going 45 degree. Then open your knee towards forward, where the direction you're going to. Open your leg as you're landing the toe towards forward, back leg pushing forward, body turn forward. Bounce back. Open your right toe, left toe off the floor. Knee 45 degree, that's the key. Open your knee first. Step out, land it, and push. Coming back, open your toe, off the heel, toe off, 45, open your knee, straight forward, land it, toe forward, and bounce back, and off the floor, turn 45, step out, 45, finish. Couple details, follow me while we're pushing. I'm gonna step down and step by step follow. Sinking down, one open knee, all right? Step forward, watch. Bounce back, one, open your knee, two. Three, off the floor. Four, open your knee. Five, land it. Six, pushing forward. Bounce back, one, open your toe, two. Three, up the floor. Four, open your knee. Five, land it. Six, pushing forward. If you have a hard time to root it down, I want a deep exhale. I'm tired too. Knee up. Boom, we're training. This is what the basic Kung Fu is about. Every single detail counts. Our leg muscle, our foot muscle, a smart ankle muscle. That's what we're training about. Finish. Stepping is a big part of a training process. Before we get into 24, 42, 48, swords, everything. The martial arts concept is all from the footwork, our root. Like I always telling people, 
the taller the tree is, the deeper the root are. So we have to practice our root. So it doesn't matter what age, when, when you need it, you have it. The older we get, the weaker our leg is. So as we're getting older and older, we have to build our bottom foundation as a martial artist. Now let's see my footwork. We can go to lower position and follow the footwork step by step. Please pay attention on my foot position. Important so you don't hurt your knee. Sit down. Open your toe. Land it. Watch the second I land my back heel off. Most people feel the knee is twisting is because your heel is not off. And as you're off, see my hip is going to the 45. Then the foot position is so comfortably set up yourself and going forward off the floor. See the knee is going to the front other knee, right? As you're finished parallel with each other, open your knee and stepping forward, land it, travel. Back leg is kicking out, absorbing. Okay, that's how you set up the knee from other side. Take a look. Position myself from here. Exerting, open, off the floor. This has to be off the floor first. Position your hip. Then off the floor, off your toe, open your knee, stepping out, boom. Watching from the front. One, see my toe. Two, step down. Three, has your step down, back heel off the floor first. Then, see my hip is not against yourself. The knee is going forward. You're not twisting your knee. And off the floor. You see that? Open, stepping out, land it, toe land forward, back leg kicking forward, and bounce back. Very important. Pay attention to the back leg timing off the floor. That's what Kung Fu is very tiring as you're taking off the floor and make sure there's a line between your legs. So you're not fouling. You're not stepping on the balance bar of the floor. And open up, stepping out, land it, pushing forward. Finish. Again, today we're training about our basics, steps. From front, from my back, from the sideways, you can tell the timing of the step is the key. Yang style is all about speed. That's why it makes the Kung Fu movement so smooth. Move like a water. How to move like water is because our bottom Kung Fu supporting the whole entire body and control the entire movement speed. So most people feel knees hurting is because number one, they're, when they're sitting down, their body lean forward too much, and that's why whole body weight is going to the one point, which is your knee point. Number two, when you're stepping forward, your foot is not off the floor, make your body fully comfortable to moving forward. That's why you're twisting the knee. So all those points are stopping you to make a smoother transition and make your body hurting much more. So I hope today's point, all the details training can help you in the future. Every time when you do steps, you have the correct step. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I'll keep moving forward to teaching you for the next movement. Thank you for watching.